Hi, I'm Michael from Spotlight and I'll be taking you through the process of how to get started by adding your categories and products. It's quick and easy. You need to create your category first and once that's created you can create products within that category. When you first log into Spotlight we'll ask you a few questions about how you plan to use the product. You can choose to start with sample data created by us or you can add the information yourself from scratch. The process is the same regardless of which option you choose. For this tutorial, I've chosen to start without any data, so I've entered my industry and company type as well as my company URL and clicked the Go To Products button. You can see that my products page is empty and I'll be starting from scratch. OK, so first of all, let's start by adding a category. Let's say I want to track mobile phone prices across a few online retailers. I'll add my first category by clicking on the Add Category button. I'll enter mobile phones as my category name since this is what I want to track and then I'll click the add category button. My mobile phones category will be created and the add product field will appear underneath it. I can now add multiple products within the mobile phones category so that I can track all their prices. Okay, let's say I want to track prices for the iPhone 7 32GB gold. I'll click the add product field and then type the product name. I then click the Add Product button and the product name will be added and the Add Product page URL field will appear underneath it. Great! Now that we have a category and a product created, I can add the product page URL so that Spotlight can track this product's price on the specific retailer's website. What I have to do is open another tab or window and go to the online retailer's website. Once I'm there, I go to the specific product page, in this case, the iPhone 7 32GB Gold. I copy the URL in the browser address bar and then paste it in the product page URL field in Spotlight. When I click the Add Product Page URL button, Spotlight will check if it can get the price for me straight away. I confirm the price is correct or if not I can indicate an incorrect price. The retailer price will now be listed in the product section and Spotlight will automatically update it when a price change occurs. You can now add more product page URLs, create other products or add new categories so that you can track any prices of any item that you're interested in. You can also delete product page URLs, products or categories by clicking on the rubbish bin icon on the right hand side of the corresponding item. Make sure you are aware of the information you'll be losing by deleting any items because this action cannot be undone. That's it, you're all set up. Check out our next video tutorial about how to configure your charts and dashboards. Remember, we're here to help. If you have any issues, you can check out our FAQ page or you can contact us at support at spotlight.com.au.